So far, we've shown you what most people do when they come to Desert Hot Springs. But right now, it's time for us to get out of this hot water and show you where to stay and where to eat. There are more than 85 motels to choose from, many of them sporting spas with the hot mineral water that Desert Hot Springs is famous for. In the guide we'll offer at the conclusion of this segment, we'll tell you how to get a list of these motels and how to determine those that allow families, summer adults only here. In addition to your health, your pocketbook will feel better. Prices in Desert Hot Springs are much lower than in neighboring Palm Springs. For the Wasserman family from Anaheim, it's not only the money, the crowds are less, and seven-month-old Stephanie has no objections. We uh, like to go to Palm Springs, but it's a little too crowded, so we come up here and we like the uh, hot pools a little better. Uh, and it's a little more quiet right now, especially during the uh, middle of the week. It's nice. And uh, you avoid the big crowds when you go into Palm Springs at night. It's still close enough. And yet during the day, you sit out in the sun and not have to fight the crowds. While it can get windy here, this family from frigid Canada was enjoying every frost-free minute. Tell us about the weather in Canada right now. Oh, cold, cold, cold. Cold and snow. <laughs> yeah, we drove through snowstorms. Really, really cold. For those of you with RVs, Sam's Family Spa has spaces for all types, including mobile homes. While there are hundreds of moderately priced rooms in Desert Hot Springs, you can also buy luxury if you have the bucks and privacy. This room with its own spa at the Ponce de Leon will set you back $80 a night, the cost of a plane room in some resorts. The most unusual and one of the most beautiful places to stay, the Two Bunch Palms, a room here about $45 a night. But if you have the money, you can stay in this house for $125 and ah, what nostalgia. This is where gangster Al Capone used to stay back in the 20s, and there are still lookout ports used by his bodyguards. By the way, that $125 price is for four people. Not a bad idea for two couples who want to share a weekend. Here now is a Fred and Elmer discovery, the Lido Palms Motel. Spacious rooms priced from $30 to $35 a night. Each room has a large, full-size kitchen. And after inspecting motels all over California, we have to report this is absolutely the cleanest we've found. With a kitchen like this, you can easily prepare your own meals. But Desert Hot Springs does have restaurants. And remember, Palm Springs is only 15 minutes away. For starters, Hayden's is the favorite of the locals here, primarily a steakhouse. Erickson's, they try to have fresh fish most nights. Another favorite of the locals. A recent welcome addition to this community, Humble's Deli. If Harlan Humble isn't here in person, his daughter Karen just might be, and we'll show you the usual assortment of deli foods. A good choice for a quick, inexpensive lunch. Now, you should stay at least two nights, because we have two Fred and Elmer Discovery restaurants for you. Chairs, it's a Hungarian restaurant, and it does as good a job as most Hungarian places in Los Angeles. And Costas, Johnny and Gail Costa have put together a charming Italian restaurant, and the food, it is so good that the people from Palm Springs often drive here just to dine at Costas. Now, Desert Hot Springs is not much for nightlife, but we discovered the best floor show in town right here, Johnny and Gail's son, Tony. Once your meal is finished, we'll clear the table with a spectacular flourish. Are you gentlemen finished? Well, yes, we are. Well, good. Now, that's what I call service with a flair. This is Elmer Dills and Fred Anderson in Desert Hot Springs.